10,000 free pizzas every single day. Show them your box, Dal. Really? Yes, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Guys, we're inspired by Pizza Hut giving away 10,000 pizzas every single day. And to show our appreciation, we're actually gonna cook a pepperoni pizza here at home for you guys. First thing that we're gonna need though, we're gonna need a pizza base. Now all of our products today guys, we've partnered with Woolworths, we've partnered with Pizza Hut. They just don't know yet that we've partnered with them. <laughs> we're <called> silent partners. <laughs> we're silent partners. They don't know anything about the partnership. But we might be one day. We just, we just thought it would be nice to use some great Aussie products and make a homemade pizza in honor of Pizza Hut Australia. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Let's start this off with our pizza base. Where's our pizza tray, doll? Got it there? Right here. Right there, and what do we do when we're gonna prepare our pizza tray? Oh, we're gonna spray it? We've gotta spray it with oil. <laughs> That's what spray is for. <laughs> so give your little pizza tray, guys. If and you've never used one before, just give it a light coating. Give it on both of them. If you've never used one of these before, guys, these let the air come oh, up from underneath. Drink. They make it nice and crusty. They help it. They just make everything simple, guys, if you're ever doing a pizza. So get your pre-made pizza base. If you are a legend in the kitchen, you can do it super simple by making your own pizza base the night before. <laughs> but we're not doing that. We've got four kids, four boys, four Ninja Turtles and they love pizza. <laughs> this is a super easy pizza that we're making today. We're actually just gonna make it with a few simple ingredients. We're just gonna use cheese, salami. Meat. We're gonna use meat. Lots of meat. Lots of meat. meat. Lots of meat. So while we're Amanda- using this one. <laughs> while Amanda plays hide <laughs> the salami. <laughs> while, while Amanda plays hide the salami, I'm gonna cut that up. Now, Dale, if you would like Take your yep. pizza base. You can use, as I said, guys, we're using all Australian products today, supporting the local community. If you want to use your pizza base, give that a swizzle, grab a dessert spoon, use the back of the spoon, and just swing that around all over the top and smear it across. How much of this? About half of that container. Roughly want to use 200 grams or three quarters of a cup of tomato paste on top of your pizza. We've used, actually, we've picked <coughs> Yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. We, we, we are using it. So, we're using garlic, onion, and herbs in our Legos paste today. That looks really good, Doc. Is it? It does look good. Done this before. No? That's okay. <laughs> this is like first time for us. We're using Hungarian pepperoni, <laughs> big pieces, like a New York style pizza. Is that what it's supposed to look like? Is that what it's supposed to look like? That looks bloody beautiful. You've done this before. <laughs> you've done this before. <laughs> All right, so now you've done an amazing job, Amanda, of putting on your pizza base sauce. Thanks, Dom. You're now up to the cheese. cheese. Chuck us the, the cheese. cheese. Chuck you the cheese. We're using perfect Italiano cheese. Four cheese melts. Guys, we'll always sell these in single packets for one application of your pizza. Make it super easy for you. Tip all that on there. Get it all on there. Oh. oh. <laughs> I probably would have grabbed it out, put it on there with my hands. I advise you to do that at home. Amanda's got a, a unique way of just flicking stuff everywhere. I think we need some more. Yeah, I, I think, I look. Know, people saying that's, that's one pizza. Yep, I agree with that's you. That's not one pizza. Yep. Want well, some more on there, maybe if I hadn't have taken a couple of handfuls and tried it oh, before okay. we started, it might have been okay. Someone snuck into the bag. I snuck into it. Oh, so there's yeah, a lot of cheese on that it. now. Here you go, you're more artistic than me. <laughs> Whack on your Hungarian pepperoni. You can use any type of meat. You can use any type of meat at home, guys. You can put on mushrooms, capsicum, anchovies. Get those furry fish out there on there. Oh, yeah. I love no, those furry, salty fish. They're disgusting. They're not disgusting. Look at that. <laughs> this now goes in the oven for 15 minutes, fan force 210 degrees. That's easy, that's how easy it is, guys. And we're gonna come back and taste it, but we're also gonna make another one using Amanda's short oh. pepperoni, mild salami, whatever you like to call it from wherever you live. All right, now we're up to pizza number two. All right, so we're gonna mix the same again, guys. Half the tomato base, Ooh. paste all in there. Oh, oh. oh. 
<laughs> Mina likes to drop things from really great heights. I don't, I'd get right down in there and squeeze it around if I was wearing a white oh. shirt. Oh, that's all over the table. Sorry guys, it's a low budget production for us here. They always are. But we do enjoy it. Yes, we do. I can't believe that Pizza Hut, you guys are absolute legends, giving away 50,000 pizzas, 10,000 pizzas per day. I tell you what, if we get 50,000 subscribers, <laughs> guys, here's a good opportunity too. We're not giving away pizzas. <laughs> Thank you very much. Our dog has just said for us, if you could please click the subscribe button, we'd appreciate that very much. What could we give away if we got 50,000 subscribers? We'll give away a Rolls Royce. Oh. If I go on first. <laughs> okay, we don't have a Rolls Jesus. Royce to give away. I don't mean a matchbox car, matchbox car. What else could we give away? I don't know. I'll tell you maybe what. Maybe a few people can put it in your comments. All right, if we get what to 50,000 subscribers, YouTube, listen in. <laughs> 50,000 subscribers, write in the comments what you would like to see us give away. Maybe a night <laughs> or two. Ryan might give me away. <laughs> no, no, I'm not giving you away. I'm not giving you away. <laughs> I'm not giving you away, that's okay. You're nice and safe. <laughs> you poor thing. All right, you want right. me to grab it and put I it I reckon down. grab it with your hand and okay. place it around. It'll save all right. getting all over the floor, all over the table. It still does it anyway. It still does a great job. This is a fun thing that you can do at home too, guys. You know, you can get out there, you can make a mess, you can do it with your kids. Our kids are all watching at the moment. No one wanted to be on camera. Maybe we'll get one of them to come and do a taste test when yeah, it's done. I reckon they'll want to That might be good. But bloody kids. It is. Well, it's hard to get teenagers up on your mum and dad's TV screens, isn't it? Yeah. Actually, I'm, just starting I'm best off again. just doing this. Yep. Look at that. Chuck them from just, a foot. I'm frisbeeing them just on. Just frisbee them on. There foot above the plate. Oh, there oh, you go. Oh, oh that's it. Other. Yeah, that's like, <laughs> it's like checkers. That one was kinged. Do you want to put any on, dear? No, I'm quite happy to see how you do it. That's fine. Yeah, okay. This one's going to go in the oven for the same amount of time, guys. 15 minutes, 210 forced oven. If it's not forced, crank that sucker up to about 230. Keep your eye on it, though. Especially if you've got that much cheese. It's going to go, <laughs> it's going to go everywhere. Absolutely everywhere in the oven. But the good news is the cleaning fairy comes in. The cleaning fairy does all the work. Oh, I don't have to worry Cleaning about it. Cleaning fairy doesn't want to touch that oven. <laughs> <laughs> so 15 minutes has now passed, guys. We're up to my favourite part, the taste test. I've got two of my Ninja Turtles over here now. <laughs> Not that they want to be called that. They said, don't you dare call us that, Dad. We'll throw the pizza in your face. But I said, I'm going to try it anyway and see how I go. We're going to get Amanda, <laughs> we're going to, get Amanda to cut it up. We're gonna taste test this beautiful looking pepperoni pizza. I promise not to pizza. wreck your chopping board, darling. That's all right, you cannot gentle. wreck the chopping board. I'm being very, oh. being very gentle. Very gentle. That's all right. I'm it's commercial grade, can't break it. Oh, Look out, it's lifting all the cheese. Poor pepperoni. <laughs> the poor pepperoni didn't like that. Maybe we need one of those big half circle pizza cutters from now on. You got a plate, guys, or what are you oh, doing? Okay. Dig in. Use the napkins. Take They're serviettes. We've got two of these here, guys. We're going to taste this, taste this both. All right. No. Uh, it's all right. Just grab it. Grab it. Need it. <laughs> they don't use plates normally, guys. They just stick their head in there, so I don't know why they're oh, using plates. No. You grab one, Dale. Okay. Get in there. Oh, I'll try one. I'll grab this piece over here. I'll see what it's like. First impressions looks good. Smells good. Tastes good. Oh, it does taste good. Good on your Woolworths. They sell the best local ingredients. I'm better than Pizza Hut. <laughs> <laughs> she said that is a joke, Pizza Hut. Yeah, just joking. Yes. 50 years, can't believe it, 50 years in our country, servicing everybody. Sell <laughs> <laughs> Not servicing, but selling pizzas to everyone. Oh, good. Good old Pizza Hut. What do you think of that one, Riley? You haven't said much, but you've eaten three quarters of it, so. Yeah, that's really good. Yeah. I'm expecting a positive result. How about you, Jess? Unbelievable. Unbelievable? <laughs> oh, we got uh, Jesse. All right, we're going to try this next one. We're going to clear the decks. The decks? Clear the decks. We're going to move this pizza over here. I don't know <laughs> where to. said decks, Jesse. I don't know where to put it. <laughs> we're going to grab this big cheese, hunk of cheese. 
Pepperoni, oh, look at that. This is my cholesterol bomb. This is the cholesterol <laughs> bomb where Amanda just kept no adding good, to it. No good that it hits this I'm going to eat this one too. Oh, oh. You should have seen the cheese that went in this, guys. Still oh, talking. There's another plate over here. <laughs> oh, I was carrying two plates. <laughs> <laughs> I was carrying two plates. Away you go. All right. All right, Whoa. This one's cutting faster. Look at this. Digging in. So guys, as I said, these were so easy to make. They literally took five minutes preparation time and 15 minutes to cook. So if you're struggling for something to do or you just want to make an alternative snack, not necessarily a super healthy snack, but they're pretty, <laughs> they're pretty good for, you, for, for most kids anyway. Yeah, we'll just when share one. When they come home. I'm going to share this. All right. Ready? 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 That cheese is good. There's a lot of cheese on this one, as you know. It's that hard three pours of a packet. That one's good. Oh! Hang on. Got a bit of that a, one is a, good. Got a bit of a kick. And the pepperoni is a little bit hotter. Is that a bit spicy for you? It's only mild. No. It's spicy for me. So it should be good. Oh. What? I love this. I love this. Diet starts tomorrow. My diet started last week. <laughs> I just haven't told myself about it yet. <laughs> what do you think of that one, boys? Which one's better? Mm. No one's going to be offended. I made it all. That's right. <laughs> That's right. I mean, I made all of this, so you can't, you're not going to be punished tonight for a wrong answer. I feel like this is a bit too strong. Okay. Maybe after one or two. I need something else, so. Yep. What do you reckon? I reckon that one's on The right. first one? Mm -hmm. What about you, Riley? This one's still good, it's just I prefer that one. Oh dear. That's two votes for the first one. Hmm. What are you thinking, totally? <laughs> I like the cheese on that one, but it's just probably a bit spicy. That's three for the first one. But I do like ham and pineapple, so. Oh! <laughs> That's maybe, sorry, maybe sorry next, everyone. Maybe next time you can cook something I really like. Sorry, all you Italians <laughs> out there and original pizza lovers. Ham and pineapple is very you know controversial. How basic I, am. <laughs> I love Ham the and Hawaiian. pineapple is not the done thing around here, even though we grew up on it as kids. That's why we made the pepperoni. I like the first one too. I like those big hunks oh, yeah. of salami that are on there, those big thick ones. <laughs> so, guys. Thank you very much for tuning in to our channel once again. We really appreciate each and every one of you. And make sure you put the ideas down in the bottom for our 50,000 subscriber giveaway. giveaway. We'd love to hear about that. Yep. It might be walking sticks. We might be 150 by the time we get there. But if not, <laughs> that'll be something pretty special. 